Hi everyone, this is Graham Peterson from Live365, and in this presentation we are going to go over how to connect a microphone or mixing board to your computer and broadcast live using Studio 365 Live. The Studio 365 Live is a free software application available to all Live365 broadcasters. By creating a live broadcast with Studio 365 Live, you can share your station both online and through our mobile applications to millions of listeners worldwide. So the first thing you're going to want to do is open up Studio 365 Live and log in with your username and password. And once you've logged in, go to Audio Source at the top of the window and scroll down to External Sources and select the device that you've connected to your computer. In this case, I'm using a Samson C01U microphone, so I'll make sure that that is checked. If you are using a mixer, follow the same process. Next, in the playlist source window, select Other from the drop-down menu. Now after this step, you need to designate a log file. Now a log file is simply a placeholder, and you may use any type of file, a .doc, .pdf, .mp3, the file will not be deleted or damaged in any way, it's simply a placeholder. So I'm going to go ahead and select this one right here. Click Open. And once these steps are complete, go up to the Play button and click it. It'll take a few seconds to load, but once it does, you will have a live broadcast. And you can tell that I'm live right now because the meters are moving in the box right here. Now to end your broadcast, click the same button you did to begin the broadcast. The software will ask you if you want to switch back to a previously recorded playlist or cut your broadcast altogether. I'm going to click yes here. Now if you're having issues with your microphone or mixing board, make sure that everything is connected properly and that the settings on your computer are correct. So go to control panel Go to Hardware and Sound, select Sound, and make sure that your microphone is up and running properly. You can go to Properties, go to Levels, check to make sure levels are OK. That tends to be the issue sometimes. But as you can see, my microphone is connected properly, and we're ready to go. And that's it. I'm Graham Peterson, thank you for using Live365, and we hope you come back again soon.